Hi everyone, I'm Doug with HANA Instruments, and today we're going to go over the HANA Instruments HI5522 two-channel laboratory benchtop meter. This meter is perfect for labs who have multiple tests performed on one or many samples. The meter supports pH, electrical conductivity, TDS, salinity, resistivity, millivolts, and ion selective measurement. This benchtop pH meter is an essential tool for any lab. Rich in features and completely customizable to user-specific requirements, the HI5522 delivers precision and performance for the most demanding tasks. HANA Instruments provides you with affordable and accurate equipment to help you achieve professional results. Inside the box, you'll find the base plate, screws, and the electrode holder. To attach the holder, screw the base plate into the bottom of the meter and slide the arm into place. Once that is assembled, you can begin setting up your meter. To set up your meter, first insert the probe and electrodes into place. The meter is supplied with the HI1131B glass body combination pH electrode and HI76312 four-ring conductivity probe. You'll also find the HI7662 temperature probe for compensation on pH measurements. On the back of the meter, you will see inputs for each channel. Attach the desired sensors to the inputs and make sure that each connection is securely fastened. Once the meter is on, you'll find that there are many different options to choose from. We recommend starting with the System Setup. Press the Setup button and then System Setup. This area of the menu lets you set the date and time, GLP data, and LCD settings. You can also view information about your meter and other operational preferences that you can set to your liking. If you have any questions about the setup of this meter, contact us at sales at our professional staff can guide you through the setup and get you up and running in no time. Once you have set your preferences, hit Escape, Setup, and then pH Setup. This area of the setup menu is where you can change your temperature compensation settings, calibration preferences, and calibration reminders. The pH Setup menu is a great way for you to ensure best practices for your lab are being followed. You can also view the conductivity setup by selecting the appropriate channel and going into the setup. You will find everything you need to customize your measurements here. With all the options to choose from, I really recommend going through each setting to determine what will be best for you. Once complete, you're ready to begin calibrating your meter. Calibration is an important step to ensure your meter is operating at its best. We recommend calibrating before each use. We'll start with pH calibration. To calibrate your meter, press the Cal button. Then, place the pH electrode into your buffer. Make sure the sample is stirring. Use the Next Buffer and Previous Buffer buttons to match the value you're using. Once stable, press Accept and the calibration will be saved. Your meter can calibrate up to five points. Place the electrode in your next buffer or hit Escape when you have finished calibrations. A unique feature this meter offers is HANA's CalCheck. CalCheck alerts users to potential problems during the calibration of the pH electrode, like a broken or dirty electrode, contaminated buffer, electrode response time, and the overall probe condition as a percentage that is based on the offset and slope characteristics. To perform a conductivity calibration, access the EC channel by pressing Channel, then pressing Channel 2. Now, Press CAL to enter EC calibration mode. Submerge the EC probe in the standard of your choice. Be sure to rinse with standard before submerging the probe for best results. Once stable, press Accept and then Escape to save the calibration. After calibration, you can begin taking measurements. Place the electrodes into your sample and wait for a stable reading. Once stable, you can press Mode to switch between pH, millivolt, relative millivolt, and ISC. Pressing channel and then one of the dual level display buttons will let you see both readings at once. 
When viewing EC in two-channel mode, press mode again to switch between connectivity, resistivity, TDS, and salinity. So that's it. The HI5522 benchtop meter is perfect for labs who want multiple fast and reliable measurements of the same sample. You can find everything you need for your meter at hannahintz.com slash HI5522. Thanks for stopping by and we hope you found this helpful. Don't forget to like us on Facebook and Instagram and subscribe to the channel for updates on products and services. To learn more about this meter, click here. See you soon.